Assalamu alaikum everyone. Thanks for joining second episode of SSCUT virtual information session for fall admissions 2021. I am Aisha Khan, final year student of BBA program in Sir Sayyid University of Engineering and Technology. As you all know, Sir Sayyid University have already announced their fall admissions 2021 for all undergraduates and postgraduate programs in the faculty of civil engineering and architecture. electrical and computer engineering computing and applied sciences and in the faculty of business management and social sciences we have been receiving queries regarding admissions process eligibility criteria fee structure degree programs and scholarship programs that we offer so answer to your general queries we are here today along with our academic leader to help you out in this decision making process just so you know we are accepting online applications for fall admissions 2021 in all degree programs register yourself on admission portal as early as possible because the last day of submission is 31st of july and the admission test for undergraduate undergraduate program is scheduled in the mid of august the final dates will be announced soon on our official website Now let me introduce you to our panelists today. We have Professor Dr. Meer Shabbar Ali, who is the Dean of Faculty of Civil Engineering and Architecture. He is well-known academic personality and professional. He has more than thirty years of experience, and his celebrated students include DIG Traffic and DIG Motorways. Dr. Shabbar has bachelor's from NAD, master's from Oklahoma, USA, and a PhD from Birmingham, UK. He regularly advises government on traffic and transportation issue. He is author of above thirty-five research publications. Next one is architecture, Mr. Mohammad Fazal Noor, who is the chairman of architecture and environmental design. He is an architect and urban planner. He is an associate professor of architecture and environmental design at Sir Syed University of Engineering and Technology. For the last five years, he is friendly and has a great, good reputation with young people. Has a broad understanding of humanities, creative arts, and construction technology. And third one is Dr. Imran, who is the chairman of Civil Engineering and Department. Uh, he is SSUT alumni. Did his MS and PhD from University Technology Petronas, Malaysia. He has more than 13 years of working experience in with different national and international organizations as a researcher. and a structural design engineer he has designed repair damage structures and did the forensic analysis for oil and gas facilities after fire accidents dr mohammed imran is current chairman civil engineering department i would welcome all the people who have joined us today in this live session to send your queries for our panelists we will try our best to answer to your queries as much as we can my first question is for professor dr Mir Shabbar Ali, who is the Dean of Faculty of Civil Engineering and Architecture. Assalamu alaikum, sir. How are you? Doing this show. Uh, can you repeat the? Your voice is a bit uh, un unaudible. Can you repeat the question? Uh, can you give an introduction of the faculty and the program? Okay, Bismillah Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim. Uh, uh, to all the students uh, who are aspiring for admission in, in this uh, very good university, uh, I would say that uh, we are having a faculty of the civil engineering and architecture, in which we have got two. Uh, departments and each department has got several teaching programs the department of civil engineering uh, is a almost very old program i think i can say around 20 years old at uh, sir sayed university it is offering bachelor of science bachelor bsc in civil engineering four year degree program Uh, bsc technology in civil technology four year program we are also offering masters in civil engineering that is also a two years program and the fourth one is the department of architecture program which is offering a bachelor of architecture program that is five years program So, 
I could not hear you, but anyway, if uh, can you repeat this question? Why students should take admissions in this faculty and especially in this program? Uh, very interesting. Actually, civil engineering and architecture both are very, uh, uh, I would say, uh, evolving fields and they are coming up with different names and different shapes. In the civil engineering program, we have got a very vast depth of uh, like water engineering, uh, similarly transportation engineering, and our chairman, uh, Dr. Imran, will further elaborate about the structural engineering. Then we also deal with the environment and also in the architecture field, we are having a variety of uh, works to be done. So in the modern field, these things are becoming important. And the most important thing I can say that whether we are having any things uh, to be done in the terms of our economy, we always need infrastructure. So both of these departments are dealing with the infrastructure. So what are the plans for further progress in this field? They are part of the Faculty of Civil Engineering and Architecture. No, uh, my question is, what are the future plans for further progress in this faculty? Yes, okay. Actually, if I look at uh, Civil Engineering, uh, we talk about uh, 3D printing. Now the houses are based, they are built by 3D printing in about uh, five days or six days time. Uh, similarly, in the case of architecture, there are many new housing coming up in Pakistan. So this Prime Minister housing program is uh, a very, very vast and big program in Pakistan. So if I'm looking at uh, Pakistan as well as the international scenario, both of these departments are very, very important. Please uh, take the mic, uh, please. I cannot hear. So what do you think this attribute should be in our graduates? Okay, excellent. Uh, actually, uh, we find that whatever, whoever should come here, they should come with uh, trust that this is a university which is looking after uh, its students, especially our Vice Chancellor, okay. Dr. Valiuddin, has been uh, saying yeah. recently that each, each student who comes in the university becomes our responsibility. So this is actually the, I would say, the vision I would uh, transmit and convey to everyone who is aspiring for admission that they will be looked after uh, till the time they graduate from this university. Even after graduation, we are in uh, touch with our alumni. So you have got a life -flying, lifelong attachment with this university once you come in church. Okay, sir, fine. Uh, can you please tell us about the similarities just ki wajah se ye program ek umbrella mein aate hain? Very good. Uh, both do, do programs hai, they deal with habitat. Habitat ka matlab hai jo living mechanisms hai. Hamare paas housing hoti hai, roads hoti hai, bridges hoti hai, uske alawa water supply hoti hai. Har ek mein do aspect hoti hai. Ek to aspect kalata hai uska engineering design aur dusra aspect kalata hai uska uh, yani look uh, looking or what we call as how does it look from the outside so ye jo uski creativity hoti hai ye architect karta hai chahe bridge ho chahe building ho in dono ki creativity architect karta hai aapne dekha hoga bahut jagahon pe bridges hote hain bahut jagahon pe pedestrian crossing hoti hai inki jitni khoobsurat hogi utna zyada log istemal karenge 
लेकिन खाली क्रिएटिविटी से काम नहीं चलता इसकी इंजीनियरिंग ज़रूरी होती है कि वो हवा में कैसे खड़ा रहेगा कौन कितने कॉलम्स पे खड़ा होगा ये सिविल इंजीनियर का है तो ये दोनों का बहुत बड़ा इश्तराक है इसके साथ ही काम कर ओके सर थैंक यू सो मच माय नेक्स्ट सीरीज ऑफ क्वेश्चंस इज फॉर आर्किटेक्चर मिस्टर मोहम्मद फजल नूर हु इज द चेयरमैन ऑफ आर्किटेक्चर एंड एनवायरमेंटल डिजाइन अस्सलाम वालेकुम सर आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट वालेकुम अस्सलाम थैंक यू फॉर इनवाइटिंग मी टू दिस सेशन दिस माय प्लेजर सर कैन यू प्लीज गिव अ ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट योर प्रोग्राम्स दैट यू आर ऑफरिंग यस ऑफ कोर्स architecture is a five year professional degree program it is like law and medicine it is it is okay. categorized as as a as a profession in itself and we have an accreditation council which is the pakistan council of architects and town planners and this program is accredited by them this it is a our program is a multi discipline has a multi disciplinary approach that integrates humanities arts and construction and environment at sir sayed university we carry forward the innovative vision of sir sayed ahmed khan and the emphasis on social progress and scientific thinking so there is a strong uh, sense of history and culture that we sort of uh, imbibe in our student and we sort of uh, Uh, develop in them a respect for environment and respect for local wisdom and ethics it uh, architecture generally has uh, is for people with a passion for arts and we go on to and because architects go on to establish their own practices we also teach here critical thinking and uh, entrepreneurship So sir what do you think what is the scope for employment of your graduates Well uh, because architecture is sort of a multidisciplinary thing but mainly uh, people uh, graduating from architectural schools go on to be employed in architectural practices with registered architects in Pakistan uh, but but the construction in industry is much greater than just architectural practices so architects also are employed by engineers are employed by government they have an employment with uh, the construction and real estate uh, industry also then there is this whole development field so uh, so the architects also go on to become planners urban designers interior decorators and then also there is this third field of creative arts so because of our very focus on basic design uh graduates can go on to media and creative arts like creative writing and literature and journalism so there is a there is a whole lot of scope here for pe- young people who wants to study architecture uh kuch eligibility criteria jo hamare new admissions aa rahe hain unke liye agar aap kuch koi briefing dena chahe hain well uh because of this uh, diverse nature of the program we accept uh, mainly from interscience both both from uh, both from uh, medical and uh, pre engineering also and uh, it, this is also open for students who have done uh, something in arts and design also especially uh, with a levels we we really uh, invite people Uh, who have done A level to come and join Sir Syed University because uh, they they just have the good right background of thinking and uh, and a sense of history and geography. Okay, fine. So, आपको कहना है कि A level students भी इसमें apply कर सकते हैं. Yes, yes, we encourage them. Okay, okay, that's fine. Uh, so, what is the maximum duration of the course? The maximum duration of the course is a, it's a five year program. Oh, uh, divided into ten semesters, but uh, it gives there's a leverage so students can uh, choose their courses over a time period of eight years. So the minimum is five years, and that there is a range of maximum eight years. They can go on to complete the course within that period of time. ठीक है. 
सर मेरा लास्ट क्वेश्चन ये होगा कि मोस्टली पेरेंट्स एनवायरमेंटल कंसर्न होते हैं तो आप क्या कहना चाहेंगे कि ये एनवायरमेंट सेफ है लड़कियों के लिए जो कि एडमिशन लेना चाह रही हैं वेल आर्किटेक्चर में ज्यादातर लड़कियां आती हैं अनफॉर्चुनेटली वी स्टिल डोंट हैव हमारी जो नाइनटी परसेंट and 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 we feel that uh, young girls should come up in this profession uh, and and really excel in it because they really have a good sense of design and arts and colors so yeah i i i personally and also the department in itself encourages an equal participation by girls okay so that's fine thank you so much sir so our You're third welcome. panelist most welcome so our th- third panelist dr imran is with us who is the chairman of civil engineering department assalam alaikum sir how are you can you hear me sir okay we will wait for dr imran uh jab tak uh okay so dr imran hamare saath hain assalam alaikum sir how are you hello assalam alaikum how are you thanks for having me here fine uh sir can you please brief our audience about your programs okay uh so uh civil engineering department was established in 1996 and currently we have around 800 students Uh, for who are doing bachelor's in civil engineering we also have a uh, bachelor's uh, ms in uh, civil engineering which means that currently we are offering a masters in structural engineering we also have uh, nationally and internationally qualified uh, faculty members who are teaching uh, in this department and we do have a state of the art laboratory which uh, we are mm-hmm. enabling our future engineers to have a hands on experience in this our program is accredited with the higher education commission which is hsc and also we are also got accredited uh, for our batch 2016 and onward uh, for uh, pakistan engineering council so this is a brief overview about uh, department of civil engineering so this is all uh, about ओके सर व्हाट इज द स्कोप एंड रोल ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियर्स अगर आप थोड़ा बहुत बताना चाहें इसके बारे में या एक्चुअली इट्स अ क्वाइट बिग क्वेश्चन एंड क्वाइट इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन इट्स आई वुड से आई वुड कंसीडर दिस एज अ मदर ऑफ ऑल फील्ड्स बिकॉज़ फॉर एग्जांपल इफ यू हैव टू कंस्ट्रक्ट योर ओन होम फर्स्ट यू हैव टू हैव अ बजट सो फॉर दैट बजटिंग यू नीड अ क्वांटिटी सर्वेयर सो later on uh, when you are going for soil testing you need a soil testing machine and then we have a uh, infrastructure then you have to go for soil testing and project management all of these details you need and these are the all in these all steps civil engineers are involved so i would say from planning till designing till execution and until even for repair and maintenance civil engineer in, in is involved in each and every step so what are the future of opportunities for civil engineers in pakistan and as well as abroad actually uh, civil engineering currently now as uh, prof shapar said that it is a emerging field and right now it's not only about the normal construction we are merging our uh, field with uh, artificial intelligence remote sensing so r- even in future uh, the other fields are incomplete without having a civil engineers because right now we are moving on smart building solutions we need to know that how our current inhabitant of the uh, people who are feeling comfortable their ambient environment is comfortable and the material that we are using we are using waste material for safety of our environment and for our to avoid carbon emission in the environment so 
having said that currently we are merging uh, we are developing different materials and we are developing new techniques to overcome the uh, current uh, problems that we are having with the environment and other issues okay so what is the fun part of being civil engineering students okay uh, that's a uh, uh, quite interesting question uh, currently uh, this is the only field uh, which have a multiple uh, field visits and outdoor visits and our labs are uh, we are uh, giving full leverage to our student to have a hands on experience for example they have a different experience in our lab when they are going to develop a new material they are going outside for field surveys and especially i saw a lot of facebook post when we have a surveying uh, experiment during our uh, sessions when they go outside and do use a different tools for leveling uh, lands and encountering the what is the exact size of land and uh, survey okay fine how strong is your alumni network and how good is the employment ratio of your, our graduates usually uh, our um, uh, i would say that uh, it's uh, immediately after graduation uh, you almost 90% students secure a uh, job even in my case where i remember when i uh, graduated from sir sayed university i took only one week rest and after second week i landed a job directly so it's also depend upon the people and uh, we also have uh, you can also develop your own business as well if you have some a small amount of budget that we are also working on it that how we are enabling our student to become a employer instead of seeking for employment courses does your department focuses on skills oriented workshops and other activities like that uh, yes uh, we have a frequent uh, workshop uh, last uh, during covid we have online sessions and even we have live sessions uh, with the national and international expert who are some sometimes they are also uh, it, they we also invite them for live sessions here and we send our student outside for learning all of these new skills and we have different uh, student uh, bodies who are enabling them to participate actively in different event organizing event and seminars and workshops so sir uh, okay kuch uh, societies ke bare mein batana chahe ki hamari jo societies hain jo ke bahut actively kaam kar rahi hain agar uske bare mein thodi bahut discussion ho okay jo societies jo kaam kar rahi hain ek to hamare different ek स्पोर्ट्स की पूरी एक है इसके अलावा जो हमारे एंटरप्रेन्योरशिप की है तो उसमें स्टूडेंट को डिफरेंट स्किल्स दिए इसके सेट्स ऑफ स्किल दिए जाते हैं कि हाउ दे आर गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट देम एंड हाउ दे आर गोइंग टू स्टैंड आउट इन फ्रंट ऑफ इन द एंटायर क्राउड अच्छा इसके अलावा जो हमारे जो डिफरेंट बॉडीज हैं मतलब ये स्टूडेंट सोसाइटी है जैसे कि यंग स्टूडेंट i would say that uh, there are few different societies uh, i forgot the name actually uh, who are working on disabled people so fine, we are yes, also fine. looking for those people who are I, i would not say that disabled people nowadays they uh, have changed this word with especially enabled people so being a civil engineering is also it is also our job to know that what are their requirement and how we are going to a merge their requirement with our infrastructure okay fine sir uh koi agar koi message dena chahe aap new admissions candidates ke liye uh Can you new message me? okay so uh-huh. first of all ek uh, jo aham cheez hai you should know what yes i can hear you am i audible yeah yeah aisha am i audible 
yes okay so message i would like to say ke first of all you should know what is your passion and secondly civil engineering a field jo hai that that's a only field where you can go into different fields like if you want to become an entrepreneur you can develop your own firm either it's a construction firm it's a designing firm or you are going for soil testing secondly uh, iske sath sath aap log jo hai civil engineering uh, civil engineering ke patte hue ये भी कर सकते हैं कि न्यू मटेरियल डेवलप करें राइट नाउ आपका जो है वो प्लास्टिक वेस्ट से रिलेटेड चीजें जो है वो काफी एनवायरनमेंट को डैमेज कर रही हैं तो हम इन चीजों पे काफी काम कर रहे हैं सो आई वुड से कम एंड ज्वाइन अस एंड बी अ पार्ट ऑफ बी अ पार्ट ऑफ सेविंग दिस एनवायरमेंट एज अ सिविल इंजीनियर ओके सर इट्स फाइन अब मेरा लास्ट क्वेश्चन ये होगा आपसे कि आपका जो डिपार्टमेंट है वो इंटर्नशिप और प्लेसमेंट्स को कैसे डील करता है वी हैव गाइडेंस सेंटर आर कंटिन्यूसली इन टच विद इंडस्ट्री एंड वी डू हैव सम पीपल हु आर लाइक दे वर प्रीवियसली दे वर स्टूडेंट जस्ट लाइक आवर नॉर्मल स्टूडेंट एंड देन दे बिकम एम्प्लॉयर दे हैव डेवलप देयर ओन फर्म्स so we are uh, in touch with them and if any student need help or if they are looking for internship we connect them with them and then they uh, easily get the hands on experience in that but uh, the main role is guidance center they keep on focusing whether they are uh, doing their job they are uh, performing good and we also connect our employer and take feedback from uh, employer that whether our student are working fine or not and if they are uh, if they are satisfying all requirement then they we also give them certificate if they are not performing as uh, expected as we are doing then we have a counseling center where we involve our counselor to guide them properly so it's a full uh, procedure uh, so that our graduates when they are graduating from sir sayed university they uh, exposed to different areas okay sir thank you so much hame itna time dene ke liye main dr uh, dr meer shabar ali ki taraf dobara aana chahungi agar wo kuch uh, short message dena chahe new candidates ke liye Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum Sir, अगर आप कोई शॉर्ट मैसेज देना चाहें न्यू कैंडिडेट्स के लिए शॉर्ट मैसेज टू कैंडिडेट इज दैट कम हेयर विद कॉन्फिडेंस दिस इज अवर्सिटी विच इज फास्टली ग्रोइंग एंड ब्रिंगिंग नेम्स एंड लुक एट मैनी सक्सेस स्टोरीज आपको पता चलेगा कि सर सैद के ग्रेजुएट्स काफ़ी चीज़ों में आजकल बहुत एक्टिव हैं और इन आई होप दैट विल बी वेरी सक्सेसफुल स्टोरी फॉर यू एज वेल और प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर मी शबरली एंड डॉक्टर इमरान फॉर बीइंग अ पार्ट ऑफ दिस वर्चुअल इंफॉर्मेशन सेशन फॉर एनी फर्दर क्वेरीज यू कैन विजिट अवर एडमिशन ऑफिस वेयर वी हैव स्टूडेंट काउंसलर एंड फैकल्टी रिप्रेजेंटेटिव हु कैन गाइड यू बैटर ड्यूरिंग द होल प्रोसेस Also, you can contact us on the numbers and emails running down the window. We are also available on Facebook, Insta, Twitter, and LinkedIn. You may join our social media pages for updated information, or visit our website for details about our academic programs, fee structure, scholarship details, and all other related information. Just a reminder that the last day of submission is 31st of July, and the admission test date for undergraduate programs is scheduled in the mid of August. The final dates will be announced soon on our social media website. Thanks for joining us. Stay safe and good luck.